got to make a video. to make a, a sequence of me running. I mean, I'm still in my room. I just wanted to do that. Okay. It's Thursday and I'm not wearing my glasses and I'm just as confused as you are. Sometimes videos don't get posted until Thursdays. Sometimes they're not even weekly. Sometimes I fall asleep in my socks. It's all gonna be okay. It's all gonna be all right. Except for the last one, uh, sleeping in your socks is never okay. You gotta, you gotta let those piggies breathe. Yesterday, I went to the eye doctor for the first time in approximately five years, and I got my first pair of contacts. This is a big deal, a huge big deal, a huge BFD, because now I can actually see. I mean, yeah, I had my glasses, but I'd been outgrown that prescription a really long time ago, so I was basically a walking hazard. I don't know why anybody ever let me drive or ever got in the car with me behind the wheel, because let me tell you, I could barely see past my arm's length, which, if your arm is about the same length as mine, is not very good at all. Just thinking about all the lives that were put in danger with me behind the wheel. <laughs> I mean, it's okay now, though. Someone could have died. Wearing contacts is cool though because now I don't have those two bars blocking my peripheral view, further adding to my inability to see. But getting them in and out of my eyes is the struggle of all struggles. It was fine yesterday because the nurse or optic assistant or whatever helped me put them in, but when I had to go home that night, it was something. I tried to remember what the nurse said about pinching and pulling, but every time my fingers got close to my eye, my reflexive blinking just made it ten times harder than it needed to be. So that oh was my task. God. Putting them in is worse. This morning, after 20 minutes of trying to fish it out of the little container and finding a good position to put it on my finger, I had to figure out the best way to stick it on my eyeball. I tried doing that looking up method, but then I couldn't really see where it was going, so I got it stuck on my cheek a couple times. Don't ask me how. I really can't see. That didn't work, so I tried looking to the side, and maybe from there I could like slide it over or something. Again, couldn't see. So I decided to stick it out and just stick it in. That is also not fun. But that's the price you gotta pay to be able to see, I guess. It it makes me a little emotional because it's really good to be able to see clearly. Like last night when I was driving home, I happened to look up at the sky and I could see the craters in the moon. Like, like who knew those were there? A very surreal moment, I almost caused a car crash, but it was totally worth it. A hazard whether I can see or not. Hey, if you wanna see more of my face, follow me on Instagram. Or if you wanna read some stupid posts, follow me on Twitter. Or you don't really have to, but it would be really super nice. They're the only things that give me self-worth.